Hello, this is Joan Rosenblum, your record courier post-game show. Wanted to talk to you about session two of day one of the Division Three State Tournament at Marion Harding. Just a thriller, and you talk about three Portage County wrestlers making their state debuts. Yes, state is a little different this year. Yes, it's a smaller venue. Yes, it's not quite the same crowd, but you're still talking about the pressure of the state tournament going against the very best competition. And today, or tonight I should say in a later session, we saw three Portage County wrestlers who have never wrestled at state before. That's Rootstown senior Dalton Duvall, Southeast junior Jaden Sapp, and Garfield freshman Keegan Sell. All three stepped in. All three had dominant first round victories today, so certainly no jitters or butterflies or anything like that. Or if they had butterflies, they were able to handle them and romp their way through the first round. And then all three took a lot of pressure in the quarterfinal. All three were involved in extremely, excruciatingly tight matches. Obviously, the number one example would be Dalton Duvall, who was actually down 7-2 and 8-4 in the final minute of third period, somehow scores a couple of late takedowns in the final 25-30 seconds to force overtime. He ends up winning 10-8. Uh, for Keegan Sell, he also faced pressure in his quarterfinal. Uh, he was down one nothing in the middle of the second period, got a takedown to take a 2-1 lead, tied at 2 entering the third period, and he gets the escape uh, to ultimately win the match 3-2. And then for Jaden Sapp, he was involved in a thriller as well. Now, he was in front the entire way in his quarterfinal. He had an early takedown in the first period for a 2-0 lead. He had a reversal early in the second period uh, to take a 4-1 lead. But he had to gut it out at the end for a 7-6 victory. And then the other two wrestlers in this evening session, uh, Tyler Knight uh, lost in the quarterfinals, but he's able to bounce back. Um, in his consolation bracket, so he'll wrestle into Sunday, and he's going to place and earn all Ohio. And then you've got Nick Sky, who falls. Uh, he, he went one and two at state, but what a remarkable career for Sky! A four-time state qualifier, uh, one of the first kids in Mogador history to achieve that feat—a very rare feat in general. So, really, for all five uh, wrestlers who competed tonight, a lot of wonderful things you can say. And again, for those state newcomers making their state debuts, wow! What can you say?